Sledgehammer must be the best studio for multiplayer right now, surely. Every DLC map and every DLC gun has been really good. This time we have the Moors. This might even be the best sniper in the game, and that is saying a lot considering the competition. The Moors has returned. The sniper from Advanced Warfare is back. This time without any loot box shenanigans to go along with it. This thing sounds amazing and hits so hard. I've not had a single questionable hit marker in the entire time I've been using it. It's been a lot of fun. So the gun hits really hard out of the box, but it's quite sluggish and you do get caught out when you're fighting multiple people at once. So I added the Crown 50 barrel for a boost to sprint to fire and hip fire spread, along with a smaller boost to movement speed and aim down sight speed. This really makes a difference when you're playing aggressively with the Moors. I wanted to add even more speed on top of what the barrel offers, so I went with the SL Razorhawk Laser for lots of improvements in the form of aim walking steadiness, tack stance spread, sprint to fire speed, and aim down sight speed. All of these combined with the barrel make for a very fast moving build, especially useful on smaller maps where engagements are constant. This one was a bit tricky. Initially, I was using the Jack Glassless Optic, but once I started using the Moors Dot Sight, I haven't looked back. Personal preference might be a factor here, so maybe try them both out and see what suits you best. Both are viable options though, for sure. Speed was definitely my main focus with the Moors, as it really did feel slow while in stock form. I also added the Super Light 90 stock to further improve the mobility of the weapon, adding a big boost to sprint to fire along with improvements to movement speed, aim walking speed and hip fire spread. Lastly, I added the Quick Bolt for a decent improvement to rechambering speed to help with the fire rate on the Moors. This is really essential for the gun to function as intended. I also realised that there was a way to make it even faster that isn't available on other snipers by using the Mag Holster gear for improved reload speed as the gun is technically reloading between every shot. This makes a big difference to the speed of the Moors. So that's how I've set up the Moors Sniper Rifle. This thing really is a lot of fun to use, and I do believe it to be the best sniper in the game currently. I've certainly had the seal of approval from the trash talkers on the enemy teams. If you think I should have gone with a different attachment on the Moors, then let me know what you think in the comments. But if you found this video helpful, leave a like, and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already for more videos just like this.